I was cycling down the Edgware Road. It was perfect. Grey pavement, dirty smudges, one red telephone box. Alpha Rabbi Pharmacy, Abu Ali Restaurant, Argos, Islamic Bank of Britain, Summerfield. The day is falling off me. Al Baraka Supermarket, Al Safir Salon, and the ache within my calves makes my pale indoors life natural. Tesco Metro. Beirut Express, Himalaya Carpets Limited, Halal Fish and Chips. I sip shallow breaths of city dust, watch men in wicker chairs just there next to me, drink coffee and juice, talk quickly, smoke cigarettes and peach shisha, sweet and rich. This is the first time you heard that record that sings to you of summers yet to come. So... I was cycling down the Edgware Road, and then I saw him. He was perfect. Maybe 50 feet away, smart dark suit, black briefcase. Weary of the rush, but late. His expectant eyes scan the swollen current of this river from its bank until there is one now. Black cab, no passengers. He lifts his hand to signal. Should be home already. This one's mine. Right, so I was cycling down the Edgware Road, and then I saw him. I'd been waiting for a moment like this for some time. It was perfect. Because at first, I thought that by the time I reached him, he might be gone, or worse, that the voice of sensible inside my head would make me bottle out and drag me home and watch me chalk this up on my extended back brain blackboard of regrets. But then the bus in front moves. It's now, feet push, pedals, spokes, whir, wind, perfect. Because as I get close, he's still waiting. Arm out, palms spread wide like he's waving. I take my left hand off the handlebars, raise it high behind my head and slap it hard against his outstretched hand. One, two, three, four. And yes, as high fives go, it was perfect, crisp. Clean, with a genuine connection. The type to leave your hand tingling with the memory of the sound. As for him, his reaction, and the street around him, I don't know. I didn't look back. Thanks. <laughs>